Bang! Neves Knives, I'm Jared, and today we have a bunch of new Kaiser models. Starting it off, the Kaiser Aggressor. 154 CM steel, obviously comes in different handle materials. It is pretty thick, and that's the one thing you notice. The handle has a pretty thick handle. The front flipper works really, really good. It has a great detent for front flipping action, and it has the exact kind of jimping you want to see on a front flipper. It does go all the way up to the top. It doesn't go over and around, but it goes up high enough where you have a great snappy action. Very, very smooth. Now, the one thing though is that, like I said, it's a little thick. So, you know, you can kind of tell that the scales are a little bit wide, but it, it makes for very comfortable ergonomics. And like I said, in the front flipper works great. So that's not a complaint, it's just an observation. And yeah, pretty cool. We have a deep carry clip with flat screws. And yeah, just a quick first look at it. The next one is the Bugai, the Kaiser Bugai. This knife has belly for days, lots of belly. Uh, shout out to Stasa 23. It has a dual grind. So like up here in this nose, that's gonna be a little bit tougher. Maybe if you, you know, wanted to bear down and scrape a little bit, possibly some extremely light duty prying, maybe, you know, and I'm not telling you to pry with your knives, I'm just saying, you know, uh, that, you know, it, it's like a swedge up there. So it is nice and slicey in this area, 154 CM steel again, good access to the lock bar, very, very smooth on the drop. The thumb flick is really good. I will say this does kind of come out a little bit, so when I'm opening it, I, I hit that, but it's not uncomfortable or anything, and the reverse flick is also really good. As you can see, we have two different color patterns here. I'm sure it might even come in more. I'm not sure if this is the only two colors. Oh, there's the name right there, the Bugai. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, I would say that it's not personally my style. I do love the ergonomics. It's very comfortable. I love the action. I love the smoothness. I'm just not a fan of big old bellies like this. You know, unless if I'm like hunting or doing something like that, I like a little bit lower facing tip. Now you can get to this tip and I do like that it is robust up here. So it's going to be tougher. So if you're doing things, you know, that, uh, that require either one, a belly or require a little bit tougher of an edge up in the nose, then these would be a phenomenal for you. Now, the last one is my favorite of the bunch, the new XL, and we'll pull up a regular one so you can see. This is the Kaiser Original XL. So we have a titanium frag one. Do you guys know I, I love titanium? So, and then it has a milled titanium spring deep carry. So it's a milled deep carry pocket clip that has a frag pattern on there. That is amazing. Incredible action. And just so you guys can see the size difference, here is. The, the original, original. <laughs> so you can see it is quite a bit smaller. However, the XLs are not big knives. So even as far as the small one goes, you know, it's more of a, it is a smaller knife, but it's not a small knife. It's more of a medium size, you know, on the, on the bigger end of small. This one is actually a, I'm not even gonna say it's a full size. I'm gonna say it would be considered a medium size knife. This is gonna be a perfect size for most people. Not too big, not too small. Phenomenal action from the button lock. And the frag pattern one obviously is a little bit more premium. The, the blade steel is S35VN on this one. This one I think is 154CM. Yeah, 154CM and then S35. But just a quick look at these new models from Kaiser. Like I said, this one's my favorite by far. I personally love the original. I think the original is a fantastic, um, I mean, you, I guess you could use it, you could use it as a primary, but I look at it as like, it's a perfect backup. Like it's a great backup knife. However, you can carry it as a primary. I mean, especially now the XL size one, you could definitely carry as a primary. It's that, that really good size that's gonna work out for most people. But anyways, until next time, peace.